This video tutorial will help you get started using the Wayside Publishing Learning Site with the Canvas LTI EDU app integration. It will highlight the features of the integration and show demonstrations of how to create activities, review student submissions, and provide feedback. Learning Site can be accessed through the LTI EDU app once it is added to a course module. The app can be set up to embed Learning Site within the module or load it in a new browser tab or window. You can change this setting at any time or add the app to multiple modules within the same course. After logging into Learning Site, you will see the main sidebar menu and Explorer Classes dashboard. The main sidebar menu provides quick access to Learning Site tools and features, such as your Flex Text Library, the Integrated Portfolio, the Instructional Strategies Toolkit, and professional learning opportunities. You can also access your profile page, stay up to date on Explorer Class activity, and learn more about enhancements to Learning Site. The Help menu gives you access to guides, live chat, video tutorials, support center, and ways to contact us. The Explorer Class dashboard is where you can access all your Explorer classes, view assignment data, and get performance rating totals. Use the quick links to directly access FlexText, engage with instructional materials and resources, monitor student progress, manage assignments, and adjust class settings. Select classes from the main sidebar menu to return to the dashboard at any time. Within each Explorer class, you will find a variety of instructional resources and activities. We will focus on creating assignments, reviewing student submissions, and providing feedback for three common digital activity types, tasks, forums, and documents. Task activities such as multiple choice, audio or video recordings, written responses, and file upload provide multiple attempts for student improvement. To assign a task activity, access Learning Site from the LTI EDU app you added to a Canvas module. Next, Locate a task you wish to assign on the Explorer Content page, Assignments page, or from the FlexText Compass icon. From the Compass icon, you can quickly assign a task by selecting the Actions button and choosing Assign. To open the task, you can also select the link or pop the task open into a new browser window. Both options take you directly to where the task is located on the Explorer content page. Assign the task by selecting the Assign button and following the prompts. From the Assignments page, you can assign multiple tasks at one time. Once a task is assigned, your students will receive a notification on their notifications page. And on their assignments page. Here are the steps for assigning task activities. To review task submissions and provide feedback, you will need to access the Learning Site Gradebook located on the Grades page. Auto graded task scores will appear in the Learning Site Gradebook immediately after submission. Manually graded task scores will appear after a score is entered using the Learning Site's built in grading and feedback tools. By default, the filters are not all selected. You and your students will want to adjust the filters when you first get started. You can also export your gradebook at any time as a detailed CSV file by selecting Export Grades. When reviewing tasks, you will use the tools in the Learning Site Grading and Feedback window to provide written, audio, and video feedback to students, adjust grades, navigate between students, see submission details, and remove attempts. 
You can leave time-stamped comments on recorded submissions and use the highlight tool on written student work. There is also the option to add a performance rating to integrated performance assessment tasks and to long answer, audio and video recording, file upload, and comparative recording unit tasks. To review a student's task activity, access the Learning Site Gradebook on the Grades page from the quick link on your Explorer class dashboard or from the Actions button on the FlexText Compass icon. Select the title of the assignment to view all student grades and additional details. Select the Grade button to open the Grading and Feedback window. To go directly to the Grading and Feedback window from the Grades page, select a student score. From the Assignments page, select the title of the assignment to access the quick links in the individual task on the Explorer content page. Select Grades and then the Grade button to review student submissions and leave feedback. Your students will select the link on the Grades page to review their submissions and any feedback you have left. They can also use the Add to Portfolio button to add their submission as evidence of their progress on Unit Can Do statements. Once you have reviewed student task submissions, you can manually transfer grades from Learning Site into your Canvas gradebook. Forum activities encourage interpersonal communication and build classroom community. You can assign a forum activity on Learning Site just like you did with task activities. From the Explorer content page, the Assignments page, or the FlexText Compass icon. Select the Assign button and follow the prompts. Once assigned, your students will receive a notification on their Notifications page and on their Assignments page. To view student forum submissions, you can access the forum from the Assignments page on Learning Site. Select the title of the activity to view it. Forums can also be accessed from the Explorer content page and the FlexText Compass icon. If you choose to grade a forum activity, you will enter the grades directly into your Canvas gradebook. Documents are fillable PDFs that can be completed digitally or be printed for in-person use. Documents can be assigned as a file upload task activity on Learning Site or added as a link or upload in a Canvas assignment. If you would like students to access and submit a document assignment directly within Learning Site, you will assign a file upload task activity from the Explorer content page, assignments page, or from the FlexText Compass icon. Students can either download the fillable document or open it within a browser window. If completing within a browser, students can save their changes by selecting Save with Changes in Chrome or Export as PDF in Safari. Next, students select the Add File button within the task activity to upload and submit the completed document. Documents completed as a file upload task activity can be accessed on Learning Site the same way as other task activities. To review submissions inside the Grading and Feedback window, 
You can preview or access the student's completed work as a download or in a browser window. If you would like to assign and review document submissions using Canvas tools, you will create a Canvas assignment that allows for file uploads or student annotation. To include the document within a Canvas assignment, you can access the document on Learning Site, copy and paste the URL link, or download the document and upload the file directly to the Canvas assignment. To use student annotation, select the box to enable student annotation and upload the document you downloaded from Learning Site. If you choose to assign a document assignment in Canvas, you will review student submissions using the built-in Canvas tools. As you continue to navigate Learning Site, please remember that we are always here to assist you. Our help icon, the question mark you see in the bottom left corner of Learning Site, offers quick access to our guides, video tutorials, and support center. There are also a few ways to contact us, automated chat, email, and phone. Thank you for joining me for this Canvas LTI integration tutorial. If you have any questions or would like more detailed information, please do not hesitate to reach out. Also, be sure to visit our website, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and follow Wayside Publishing on social media.